here it is the hike 100 i'll tell you there's so much on this little guy right away on the outside you can see that exoskeleton i mean you can hang kayaks and bikes and all kinds of stuff from that it's solidly built inside and out so you have this huge wheelbase which is what it's all about i'm going to show you from back here look how wide that is it's, it's wider than the camper and the fenders are super solid and they fold and they fold open you can open that you can open this so you can use it for putting a grill on there's a little bit of storage in there if you attach a grill there's a spot for propane you can see right here it has we got trucks going by I can't hear anything you got uh, electric stabilizing jacks on the inside over there. I'll show you that's where the switches are. It's got a full size spare under there. This is, has a 200 watt solar panel with a 30 amp controller and it's lithium ion compatible. So if you wanted to add lithium ion batteries, you don't have to change the charge controller out. It has a little spray port right here so you can hook up fresh water spray. And then it's got some extra power on the outside. It comes with one 20 pound propane tank, heavy duty tongue jack. Swinging around over on this side. This is the dump for the toilet. It's even got extra solar hookup. You got a little plug right here if you wanted to hook extra solar. Ladder that goes up to the roof. Your six gallon DSI water heater, black tank flush, hot and cold water on this side another spot for storage look at those huge tires there's your dump look at that suspension system it is completely off-road suspension torsion axle heavy duty springs your other end of the storage is over here look how much you got huge storage underneath there there's the controls light switch so those controls are for the electric stabilizer jacks your 30 amp plug if you got cable at at a rv park you can plug in right there another spray port on this side and then i'll back up so you can see it's got this whole rear kitchen thing going on you can see again right up top here you got that exoskeleton all the way around the top and then i'm going to show you the bat wing awning that comes with it also on when we get on the inside so it comes with this portable fridge freezer Pretty slick, a little spot for hanging stuff, attaching things to the wall there. It comes with the little hot plate, so you have this whole kitchen set up back here. And you can see you have all this storage, and the storage that goes to the inside of the camper too. And there's your two LED lights out here, LED lights in the back, your access. Let's run inside and see what the 1316 FB has got a electric power awning with awning lights so when you first walk in more storage underneath there your breakers and fuses there heater there hanging storage there your thermostat the door to the bathroom fridge right there storage underneath convection microwave oven so yes you can cook stuff in there without an oven or you can use it as a microwave pretty slick little pull out table right here so you have some extra counter space a little more storage up there all your owner's books it is prepped for Wi-Fi extender if you wanted to add that um, gas electric water heater your pump switch look there I mean you even have a tank heater all your light switches your awning is power like I said before and then you have a little shelf here with a light over your sink. A spot to charge your phone right there. More power. And let's check out the bathroom. So it's a stand-up shower, toilet, all-in-one. Now I have the shelves in here right now. So you could use it for hanging storage. Shelves or these are removable. Both of these are removable if you're not going to use them for storage. It's got a little skylight in there. LED light check this out 
toilet paper, safe from water. Put it in there, cover it up. They think of everything. Here's that hanging storage I was saying. Your air conditioner right up there. And then here's the sleeping arrangement. So you have a bunk up top and bunk and then a looks like a looks like a queen size bed down here, queen full, probably somewhere in between. If you need to know, you can give me a call. I'll measure it for you. But uh, and then you got a USB port and power on both sides of the bed. Windows on both sides of the bed. A spot for a TV up there. Now here's that bat wing awning. This is what it looks like when it's set up. So you got the one awning on this side. But then on the back and the opposite door side, you can set up another awning. And that comes with it. It's sitting right there. All that. For thirty-two four ninety-seven, you can't beat that. Look at that! More USB ports up on the top bunk. It's got a a little thing across there, so you can use it for storage if you don't have a third person with you. But tons and tons of stuff that this is loaded with. So there you have it: the Winnebago Hike One Hundred. Come check it out.